Hello guys, I'm going to be doing some ASMR watercolor. Um, this is the paper I'm going to be using. I taped it on the sides to hold it down. I'm also going to be using this palette to my left. I'm going to go ahead and wet the paper. Now we're going to um, wet it down quite a lot. I'm going to be trying to do a um, kind of like an ocean painting of the waves of the sea. Um, my trying to decorate my apartment in kind of an ocean theme or a beach house theme so I'm painting this right now so I'm taking some blue and we're going to do the sky so just light feather like strokes I'm also following a tutorial. I'll post it to the video. Um, yeah, a tutorial here on YouTube. So I'm doing it kind of like in real time. So yeah, it's not that great, but okay. We're gonna add a little bit of green to the blue. We're going to now do our water kind of just have to let watercolor flow which sometimes I have a hard time doing gotta let it work its magic Okay, we're going to take a little bit of yellow because there's a reflection on the water of the sun. So we're going to lay that in very lightly, except I put too much. So you just get some water and um, it'll take some of that off for you. Okay, so watercolor is layering light to dark I think in cr acrylic it's dark to light and oil as well so we're just gonna mix some more of that ocean water color We're laying in the different waves and it gets lighter in the more shallow areas. So we just keep layering and also you gotta let you also you gotta let it air dry too. But I use a blow dryer, you just have to let it dry between coats. So now we're just going to darken up the sky a little bit. Going to lay our second um, color down. So it's a gradual, gradual building of colors. I'm 
making sure the paper's wet so it blends easily. We're gonna get a little bit more of the green colors for the um, um, for, for the shore area where it's not as much water. I guess I'm trying to say. <laughs> so yeah. Yeah, my zipper and my chair keeps making sounds. So. In the beginning, it kind of sounded like, um, I farted, but I didn't. Let's <laughs> bring in that yellow one. Now we're going to deepen up the horizon line. We want this pretty um, dark compared to the rest of the ocean water. Just adding in more blue. As you can as you can see with the sky, as you let it dry, it gets um a lot lighter in color. That's why with watercolor you have to continually build up the color. Oh, and here I am blow drying. This is how I dried it. So you can have like those little runs and stuff on watercolor. It makes it more interesting. If you like that. I don't know what I'm doing there. Yeah, but you can get the stuff that you, it's kind of like glue. And you put it down and you paint over it and then you peel it off at the end of your painting and it'll be white, completely white. That's how you get white in your painting. Or you can use acrylic paint like I did in this um, painting. Okay, we're going to Keep darkening.
I'm making that horizon line even darker. So I just keep building and building. Which I'm not that great at watercolor, but I really need more practice. Practice makes the perfect. And practice makes progress. Okay, so I'm just going to continu continually, I'm just going to continually add more paint. Again, I'm darkening the horizon. Um, that's very true. I do have a bad habit of just keep going and going. Um, I put that in there because I'm also going to do a silent video. I took a poll on my channel posts, um, and 3% of you like no talking videos. So that video will be for my 3%ers. Yes. Let me know if you like the voiceover type of videos. Okay, so back to the blow drying. Okay, now she told me to, in the tutorial, to take some white acrylic paint 
for like the white part in the waves which I just randomly placed I'm, 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 I'm gonna try to redo this painting um, and take my time see if I can do it better See, I probably should stop right here, but I just keep going. Let's look at them. It was fun. Tap, 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 tap. Explosive. Just going to do a little bit more. Um, oh, we're going to. 
gonna go in and make the clouds darker so here we go laying in the cloud color which is just the blue on this one so let's go ahead and darken that up a little bit do you see what I mean? Um, you could barely see the cloud after it dries because the colors really do get a lot lighter as they sit. great with clouds. Um, I, I need to do some more practice with them. Um, let's see what we can get today. I'm adding some yellow for the sun. Okay, we're going to now blow dry in the clouds. Okay. Just gonna do a little bit more, which I should have stopped a long time ago. Let's make a sound him. Put in those details.
Okay, our final blow dry. So that's my painting from me watching that tutorial. And this is what I came up with. And here is me peeling off the tape. Okay guys, here's the final product. Um, if you like these painting to, um, videos, let me know and I can try another one. Let me know what you want to see. Yeah, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope it relaxed you and I hope you have a lovely day. Bye guys.